The residents on Friday turned out in their names for the Open Our Borders Now demonstration. The demonstration, which started from Denu Junction Friday morning, took demonstrators through the principal streets before running up at Victoria Park, Aflao. The borders were closed in March 2020 as a measure to control the importation of coronavirus into the country. Participants noted the closure of the Ghana-Togo border has collapsed their businesses, calling on government to open the border to revive economic activities in the area. told us that the COVID has come to stay. The airline has been open. Then why don't we open our land borders because of the closure of the border? Look at the way we are suffering, my brother. Sometimes when you go in and out, zero. In and out, zero. So we are suffering. We are appealing to the government to open the borders for us, to move in and out, to get something to our kids to chop. A border resident, Vincent Yao Ajoga, is one of the conveners. Many people pass through the airport as well, and the president does that. We are suffering as, you know, people living along the borders, we are just suffering. You know, some of us, we have our parents, our relatives living in Togo. It is difficult for us to cross to Togo. Member of Parliament for Ketu South, Jifa Abna Gomeshi, also called on government to open the land borders. When Accra and Kumasi were locked down, some provision were made for them. Some social interventions were provided for them. What about the border communities? We've been locked down for one and a half years. The tidal waves have devastated our communities. We are on our knees and we are suffering. We are asking the Republic of Ghana to take care of the citizens of Kutu South and all the border communities. The organizers presented their petition to the Municipal Chief Executive of Kutu South. The convenience threatened to hit the street again if their petition is not considered. 